What's up guys? My name is Bronze Codes and I am going to be teaching you guys how to make a Discord bot in Java. So first off, the program that we'll be using is IntelliJ and Java development kit will be needed and the Java runtime environment will be needed as well. And they both need to be the same version. All the downloads will be in the description. And yeah, let's get started. Let's do it. So once you guys load up IntelliJ, make sure you guys just get the community version. That's all you need for now. We're going to do create new project. We're going to go to Maven. So it'll be Java first, but you want to go down to Maven. And then you want any version to be honest, but I stick with 1.8 because I do Minecraft development as well. I'm going to push next and then you're going to give it a name. So we're going to do the tour bot. Then we're going to go into artifact coordinates. Also, we're going to change where this is going. So now that I've got the folder, you want to do a backslash and then let's just do tutorial bot. Now here we're going to do this can resemble a domain. So for instance, mine is codes bronze. It's always so my website is bronze.codes. But you always want so like if yours is google.com, it would be com.google. So I'm gonna do codes.bronze.tutorial. Just that tutorial. That works. And then we're gonna leave this the same name as this, and we're gonna make this 1.0.0. .0 .0. We're going to click finish. Now, after this has loaded up, you will have to copy and paste the dependency and the repositories and paste them right here. So make sure to always include the dependencies in brackets and repositories in bracket. And then you're going to click this button. If you don't have this button, then right click and go to Maven and reload project. So mine has finished on the bottom. We're going to go into here. We're going to click source and then we're going to go into main and then we're going to right click Java and create a package. This package will be called the same thing as up here. We're going to do codes bronze tutorial. Boom, push enter. That creates a new package, which essentially is a folder. We're going to create a new Java class. And we're going to name it tutorial bot. Because why not? Okay, so now that we have our class made, we will go inside these brackets. And we are going to first do a public static. <clears throat> JDA builder. We're going to call it builder. Then in, inside here, we're going to type in main. And then this should pop up. If it doesn't, then you're going to have to type it out as it shows when I click it. So if it doesn't show, make sure you type this out. Now we will do a string and we're going to call it token equals and then just keep it empty for now. Then we are going to do a builder equals JDA builder dot create default. And then we're going to do token, even though this will not work until we get our actual bot token. So now let's go get our bot token. So I am at my developer portal for Discord. And to get to yours, you will click the link in the description for the portal. And we're going to go to create new application. We're going to name it Discord cut, or, oops, cut bot. Good. So now we have this. And we're going to go to bot. And then we're going to click add bot. Yes, do. Now, 
we're going to copy this token. And we're going to go back into IntelliJ. And we're going to paste that right here. Now there's a few extra steps that we have to do for our bot to completely work as we want. So we are going to do a builder dot disable cache. And then we're going to do cache flag activity. And then let's do, let's do a member overrides. And then let's do a, um, a state. There we go. So we're going to disable all that cache. Always want to space out your code so you know what you're doing. <clears throat> and then we're going to do a builder dot set bulk, I believe. And then we're going to make that false. Boom. And then we're going to do, we need to set the compression. Compression. And then compression dot none. And then let's do a builder dot that activity so this is where you can actually have some mobility plane and then hello so we can make this plain make it plain minecraft plain discord so now if this happens i don't know why but my friends computers this doesn't happen what you're gonna do is you're gonna hover over it and it says language level five. So you're going to want to go to file, project structure, go to modules, language level, and you're going to make it eight. And push apply and okay. And now that error should go away. Then we're going to do builder.inherit. Actually, it should be intense. And then let's do a gateway intent dot guild member guild member there it is so now on top of this we're good so now all we need to do is builder dot build and I forgot to include up here you always have to do throws login exception just in case if the bot does not feel like working and there's something going on in the background now we want to make our own test server called bronze's server and then here we go and then we are going to go back to discord and we will make it a administrator and then we're going to go to o auth 2 and we're going to have to click bot and click copy so now once we copy this we can paste this in now it says tutbot and then let's go to This one, boom, off the right. There it is. Good to see you, top up. So now it's offline, of course, because we have to start it. Now, how we can start it is we go to IntelliJ and we click the run button, run tutorial. And then it should come up with a message here. Okay, so this is another issue that I forgot to mention that happened to me specifically, but may not happen to you. So I'm going to show you how to fix this. So what we need to do to fix this issue is go to file. We're going to go to settings. And we're going to go to build, execute, and deployment. Then we're going to go to compiler. Then we're going to go to Java compiler. And we're going to select eight here. And we're going to take this, and we're going to minus it, and then push apply and OK. Hey guys, before trying to start your bot, make sure you go to the Discord developer panel and you go to Privilege Gateway Intense. You turn this on and turn this off and make it an Then save changes at the bottom.
Now, let's try to launch our bot. Our bot is up and is playing Discord. Awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And next video, we will be getting into how to do commands and hello world. So when someone says hi, it will talk back and say hello back. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and you learned. I look forward to teaching you more about Discord development. Peace out, guys.